act, you know, misbehave. <laughs> I didn't have no parental guidance. <laughs> Daddy was going to work, mama was going to work, but I had the house to myself. Oh my God. Man, that's right, brother Julie. <laughs> I turned it upside down. <laughs> went outside, went under the tree, and the bird dropped his drop on my head. <laughs> <laughs> Sister Portia asked him, went back inside, didn't have enough sense to wash my head, got a pair of clippers and tried to cut it out. <laughs> <laughs> I ended up cutting a plug in my head. Mother came home and told that big old lie. That a boy had a rock and hit me in the head with a rock. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I had to plug in my head. <laughs> you see? I've learned young how to lie. Yeah. But you know, y'all can learn young how to lie yeah. too. Yeah. 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 Invite me into your home and I won't take nothing in your home from you. 
because it doesn't belong to me. To where I respect your person and you respect my person. Amen? Amen. Amen. And when we do that, brothers and sisters, and we do it in a very decent and orderly manner, God blesses us. Mm -hmm. But when we turn from that and we do destructive things, we not only end up hurting someone else, but we end up truly hurting ourselves. Mm -hmm. Hurting ourselves. Mm -hmm. So God says in verse, verse 4, look at verse 4. Listen to what God said. And I will set up shepherds, shepherds over them. Shepherd which shall feed my flock. Feed. Well, those pastors that God was against, they was feeding the flock too. Mm -hmm. So the question is, what are these pastors feeding? Right. And See, when you come to New Life, you know what Reverend Harris and Reverend McCoy feed. That's right. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. True. We feed some soul food up in here. Right. <laughs> huh? Is that right? <laughs> Man, wasn't no chicken left last week. No chicken. <laughs> soul food up in here. That's what we feeding up in here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And when the word is preached, it got soul in it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You can smell it. Yes. Uh -huh. It nourishes the body. Yes, sir. You feel Yes, sir. You feel like me? Uh huh. You got it? Yes, sir. Because, because God is feeding us. Mm -hmm. Amen. Oh, you go into that Howard church. Yeah. You get a lot of Howard. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. <laughs> you just woke up this morning and your whole family's hot. <laughs> <laughs> you come to church and the church is hot. <laughs> and when you leave the church, you ask the question, Lord, what did you want me to know? So I go to school. Yeah. I go to work. I ain't feeding the people what God sold through. Uh -huh. I'm hot. Oh, <laughs> because that's my environment. Oh. That's what I'm talking about. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> so you go to Manchester Mall, what do you see? Ha. Oh, yeah. Fighting. Right. Um, cussing. Yeah. Um, you come to church, what do you see? Ha. Oh. Fighting. Cussing. Mm, you right. go on the job, what do you see? Ha. Fighting. Cussing. Yes, sir. You go to the post office, shoot. They shoot, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, they shoot. Yeah. Oh, they shoot. They yeah. shoot. Yeah. <laughs> we need God. There we go. We need God. So God says, listen to God now. He said, I will set up shepherds mm -hmm. over them, which shall feed them, and they should fear no more. Mm. Listen, listen, when you fed the wrong food, that's why today you and I are controlled to being nothing. is because this world has made us so fearful. Yeah. We fear for even coming to church. Yeah, right. yes. Yeah. Yes. We fear for even to step outside our front door. Mm. We even fear for to go and vote. Yep. Even a registered vote. Mm -hmm. right. Huh? That's why I'm so proud of the Brown family. It's because they stepped up and they went to the Franklin Unified School just because they love children. Yeah, that's so. And they took time out, wasn't that long? And it made a difference. Right. It wasn't fearful. Hmm. It wasn't fearful. It wasn't fair. My sister Melissa, man, she had on the earpiece. <laughs> man, she'll run around now. 
No difference between channel 24, channel 30, and Sister Melissa with the motherfuckers are getting paid. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that sister had just as much skill as the rest of them folks. <laughs> That was the only difference. Yeah, yes, but God is paying her. Yes, sir. And we'll pay her. Yes, sir. You listen? Mm -hmm. See? That's the only difference. And all these folks. I walk out of my house in the morning, my name. He come out. He says, Didn't I see you on TV? <laughs> <laughs> it's my neighbor. I said, Yeah, you saw me. He said, well, that was all right. Man, what was that about? You know, I said, well, I explained it to him. He said, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. <laughs> that's right. Mm -hmm. Even taking care of church business, talking to our engineer, Charles. And Charles said, uh, that's my car. I was watching TV. Wasn't that you on TV? <laughs> I said, yeah, that's Charlie. That was me. Oh man, that's cool. <laughs> now I need you to talk to my son. Talk to my son. Gave me his son's cell phone number. Huh. Talk to his son. I said, I said, yeah, church is on the move. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But you see, when you act with God, God will make you an impact on other folks. That's right. Mm -hmm. Are you listening? Mm -hmm. Are you guys literally listening? Yeah. Say that. See. So God says, and I was set up shepherds over there. So there's going to be a whole new kind of a shepherd. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Jesus represents that new kind of a shepherd. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay? Is that when Jesus came on the scene, he came feeding God's people, and God's people were responding to the food that they was receiving. Man. So much so that those other shepherds that was feeding that contaminated food got jealous. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. They got enemies. Yeah, enemies. And they delivered Jesus up because of their enemy. And they persecuted him. And they destroyed him. And so I conclude now, brothers and sisters. Listen. You still want to be a pastor? Mm -hmm. <laughs> hmm? Anybody raise their hand? <laughs> Maybe both of you. Huh? Anybody? Male, female? You know, don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Just understand is that when you determine to be a preacher, you may play with yourself. Amen. But God is not playing with you. That's good teaching. That's good teaching. That's right. And what you feed God's people. Mm -hmm. I'll come right back on you. That's right. That's Are right. you listening? Man. Are you listening, people? Yes. Whatever position that you have in church, from the highest position to the lowest position, that's a position of leadership. Mm -hmm. Man. And you best be serious about it. Mm -hmm. Because God is serious about you. Good mm -hmm. preaching. Good preaching. This ain't a game to play with. Mm -hmm. Playtime is over. Oh, mm -hmm. Some of us are still playing. Amen. Huh? Amen. Yes, if I was walking under them trees waiting for a bird drop to fall on my head, and then y'all can accuse me of still playing. But God taught me. Amen. He taught me. Yes. I don't do that no more. Yes. And so it is with you, brother, sister. Look at your life and realize Realize that the God you serve is a serious God. And what he demands from you as well as me is our life. Yeah. Nothing short of that. Our life. Nothing short of that. Because when we give him...